Welcome to the comment section madness, this time with Unknown Awakening, who just released like a few days ago, 17 October, to 40 reviews almost, mostly negative. It was a free AMD gift, I believe. Um, Unknown Awakening, not yet, Steam Charts, not yet. Ah, uh, AMD. Ah, uh, gift, just a bundle. We get one of those MDs with the game. And so some of those 40 reviews and 240 players of this game. You know, got the game for free. And Whitefield, I mean, that's part of it. It turned that good looking actress, if you know her, she's from The Witcher TV show into an uglier one it's mostly a lot of sweet babying stuff that people revolt against boycott yeah but uh, people don't like it people don't like it i'm gonna dive into the comments which i've looked through a little bit it's already fun as hell like ah anya jolotta or so anya no there she is i know her from the witcher tv show so, cool voice actress, good voice actress normally. Oh dear, with Gerard, which is a TV show. Not in that picture, we were looking, but yeah. The trailer, by the way, got like almost 100,000 views. And the game, like poof, 97 goddamn players. It's, it's, it's brutal, it's brutal. How low of a goddamn concord viewership playership this game has disgusting even i know i've already seen oh the modern audience will love this game all oh, 83 of that but dab that was one month ago and he's so spot on <laughs> with 97 the game is apparently a stealth game and most people criticize it because it's outdated the combat ain't fun and it's kind of bland and boring no big surprise here. I haven't read through that yet. It's just a deluxe edition with more skins for her. Yeah. But it's one of those new games that gets Concord. Of zero. Real good success there. Full player numbers. Rips baby BB Inc. The poison to many game studios. And you will be amazed. This is literally Forspoken, but they just changed the character's ethnicity. That's all I see here. Forspoken. I don't... I didn't play that. What's that? Forspoken. Oh, did not have that on the... God, um, Steam. Forspoken game. Oh, yeah. Did you have that on Steam? That I believe got a little bit more player numbers. I've seen gameplay of that. That's bleh. Yeah, look. 4,000 reviews. Let's just look it up on the Steam charts. The spoken game. Steam charts. Must have pulled in more player numbers. <sighs> All time pick 9,000. Okay, that's not good too. That came out last year, I believe. So 9,000, yeah, it's, it's not so special. Uh, where was I? Comments. Forsaken 2, Electric Boogaloo. I'm glad I looked that up for the next Forsaken meme. I love the Brio, the bonus screen pants, blue pants, red pants. Yeah, I just looked it up and different hairstyles. Is this a DIY game? It is. Sweet baby, this. Destroyer of Studios has been detected. That's mostly what people boycotted. Don't know the backstory of Sweet Baby Inc. Yeah, I won't explain it. What in the audience is? Irony, uglifying the females. You're actually being sexist by saying that all the females are ugly. This turns against you. I hate that trend. That they uglify the females in video games. Or uglifying females in video games. Where's my angel mod that I will... Play. There she is. 
Yeah, I mean, that's a good comparison picture. Uh, in a second, I'm going to start recording that and dive back into modded. <sighs> Who will be unknown? This game must be pretty unknown to the audience of gamers of the player numbers. Uh, this game is written by CEO of Sweet Baby Inc. Kim Belair herself. It doesn't get any worse than that. Okay. Understand. Oh, and the eye detected. Will it not detect that? Uh, it's probably just all sweet baby ink stuff. Is that Jennifer from that failed Netflix show? I like her in that show. I like Henry Cavill in that show. I like the Sabrina actress in this show. Yes, from the third show, but it's definitely a third show. Third, because that female director has main character syndrome and didn't want to listen to any Kevin's advice to just do the source material justice. Actually, the depressing, that's a funny way to put it. Uh, but yeah, let's not dive into that. Maybe, just maybe now, these developers will see the bad on SBI, Catrice. Catastrophe Dama Red Cat. I don't want to pronounce it a cat. Catastrophe. This actress just can't catch a break before the project she ends up with. I don't know her from anything else besides those two. Oh, there's the cutscene again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's a bad showcase for your game. What was it? Oh, Jennifer, and there we were. Darkifying in real time. Why are you arctifying female characters? She's a beautiful actress, but I heard she was intentionally made ugly in the game. I hope the developers fix this. Maybe there's a mod for this. No, this game won't get any mods. Let's be honest. Ah, this wants to be so artsy and deep. So badly without doing anything to deserve it. Yeah, that doesn't get anything different from here. Let's keep this short and not spend too much time on the Gotham comment section. The transition is an actual jump scare. Ah, I saw that and was like, yep, that's a big part of the wider game. Failed. Prince of Persia for Spoken Edition. The unknown game. To nine gamers. And wait till the game awakens. Anything else interesting? No, that's pretty much it. Pre-order now available October 18th, I'm sure. It's gonna be popular after the weekend. Because that makes sense. Silent Hill, since I play that at the moment. Oh, where's 2024 edition? You poor. Okay, that's a big difference. That's a big deal. Big difference. I should wake up before I talk about stuff. A lot of dead games here in my search bar. Besides hell divers. Everything else is dead. Blackout is something I like as a comparison. Is it called Blackout? Damn, I'm not even sure now. Um, where's my Steam page? Where's my Steam page? Of indie games. Black Tail. Black tail, strong female characters, good story, good voice acting. Like, bow and arrow gameplay, very indie. That's what I want to look up, how much that got. Black tail. I like that as a comparison. I mean, right now it came out like one, on, one year ago. Now it's also pretty low. It's also... A female lad, but that's actually a good game with 502 damn. Oh, yeah, okay. That didn't sell well. Was my Steam page again? Still hop. How many reviews? 1004. Yeah, like it's bow and arrow, it's colorful, it's dark. That's for me a good comparison. That's actually a game I enjoyed. Play. Baba Yaga. To you to curse. Oh, I swear I did off the audio. Anyways, let's be done here. 
I'll keep this short. That's all the dungeon. Do you know nine awakening this earth? Just by concrete. I did a command section madness on concrete too. Doesn't deserve more. I want let's play it. Oh, mods. Mods is what I wanted to look up. Of course they don't exist. Ah, that's just unknown. We got that for free. Of what with Space Marine? Yeah, at least one good game in there. There it is. Uh, and so some of the players who play this game got it for free. That's the funny thing. That's the funny thing. Uh, nothing exists here. Why am I looking this up? Of course nothing exists. Do you have an official website? 16. Yep. Accepting. Is there anything else on there? Probably not. Dive deeper into the game below. Ah, look, they have a big good um, picture of Vanya here. Of everything she's done. Where's the Witcher? She would. I definitely don't know anything besides the Witcher here. Army of Dead. Las Vegas. Christian Slater. Huh. That sounds familiar. Wanderlust, that sounds German. Uh, yeah, I don't know, nothing else. She's the big highlight of the game, I would say. 